Stanford University. So this technology is capable of diagnosing cancer both at an earlier stage because it's more sensitive than the current standard of care and we're going to be more confident in that diagnosis because we're going to be able to look at not just one protein, not just one tumor marker, but we can look at a whole panel of tumor markers and this will give us more information and it'll help us be more confident in our diagnosis of cancer. So by doing the protein test on blood in real time, essentially, we can tell the doctor much earlier that the therapy is not working or working, so we can actually improve the effectiveness of the drug therapy. So this platform has three major advantages over the current technologies. First of all, we can detect proteins in many different samples, which we call matrix insensitive. So if a patient has a protein in blood or in a cell uh, lysate from a tumor biopsy, we can detect these proteins equally in both samples. So if we can do a protein test before the therapy, we can predict whether that therapy will work on that particular patient or not, depending on their protein marker profiles. It also has exceptionally sensitive, so it's a thousand times more sensitive than the current standard of care. You take the average of all the four senses, right? Uh, we know that ovarian cancer is very difficult to detect, and uh, usually when we find it, it's too late for doctor to make intervention. But if we can detect the uh, ovarian cancer in stage one, that's earlier stage, and uh, that will improve the survival rate from 10% to 90%. By being able to diagnose cancer at an earlier stage and being more confident in that diagnosis, uh, we're able to hopefully save lives. For more, please visit us at stanford.edu.